James Wine is James, the wine guy. Thank you for joining me on this great journey wine today. Now we're going to review this beautiful wine. It's an Albarino from Galicia. So uh, here we go, the proper introduction of this one. It's, it's fantastic and it reminds me uh, when I'm away from Albarino and I go back to a glass and I'm, I'm thinking, where have I been? Uh, why have I been away from this wine for so long? And uh, so this is the, the beauty in, in uh, wine discovery and enjoying wine is, uh, you know, you can go and taste different wines. And I taste, of course, a lot of Sauvignon Blanc, a lot of uh, Pinot Grigio and a lot of uh, Chardonnay. And uh, sometimes those are my uh, three top white wines that I'm tasting. But when I register away from that, it doesn't mean I don't like those varieties, I definitely do, is I go to a wine like this, Albarino, and it reminds you uh, the, the delicacies and nuances you're going to find in this uh, very uh, prized wine from Spain. So here we go with the introduction of this wine. It's called Abadia de San Campio and uh, Denominación de Oriche, that's in Galician. And this is from the Reyes Baixas region in uh, Galicia, of course. Bodegas Teras Gauda is a producer, 2013 vintage, 12.5% ABV. Very simple label here. Look at that. Most of the contents are gone because I've enjoyed them. Uh, it's a fantastic wine here. Back panel for inspection. Uh, the uh, Reyes Baixas uh, certification right here. And uh, this wine is 12.5% ABV. It's a fantastic wine to enjoy with coarse seafood, but to enjoy with many dishes, uh, very simple dishes from, uh, say, burgers to um, uh, pasta dishes, but to also enjoy on its own. It's a fantastic wine to maybe put in your picnic basket for the summertime. Now, in doing so, uh, I think it's a great thing to think about. That is, if you want a different variety to, to taste uh, or take a uh, test drive, uh, so to speak, is to put this in a, in a picnic basket to enjoy with a variety of uh, charcuterie and cheeses and so forth. It's going to play quite well in that picnic basket and those people enjoying that picnic basket. It's a fantastic way of, uh, you know, putting together the beautiful acidic structure uh, to the, the beautiful proteins you're going to be tasting. Tasting the cheese and the charcuterie is a fantastic way of, you know, enjoying life and to uh, uh, bring this into the highlight and focus of your uh, afternoon in a really wonderful setting. So scent characteristics first, flavor profile, and then the point score. Uh, really gorgeous notation here of yellow citrus, almond, boss pear, whetstones, tea, and pine nuts. So here we go, the flavor characteristics next. Mmm. Really appreciable, nuanced, and uh, delicate notes, but just making quite an impression upon me. Add notes include green and golden citrus zest, pear, white fig, minerals, fennel, and freshly roasted pine nuts. So I give this wine a 9.2 out of a 10.0 scale. You can think of this as 92 points out of 100 points. Fantastic wine. Uh, be sure to pick up a bottle to enjoy. I, if you want to try one new white wine this summer, I would definitely recommend an Albarino wine. Thank you so much for watching. Please, if you like this video, please give a like right here. Also share this video. I appreciate that very much. More information on the producer will be listed down below. Please list your comments on your favorite Albarino. And uh, please uh, subscribe to my video channel right here on YouTube. Thank you again for watching. More on this great journey to come. And uh, you'll find me on Facebook, Twitter, Vimeo, Google+, and Pinterest. Salud!